Hi everyone and welcome back to the Repair and Installation TV channel. Electrical wire and cable systems play a crucial role in efficiently utilizing energy. They provide power, connectivity, and circulation, appearing in various aspects of life. They serve as the essential link between power sources and consumption, enabling electricity transmission to households, offices, and factories, improving living conditions and facilitating communication. The first step in copper, aluminum smelting is crushing the ore to reduce it to a workable size. The crushed ore is then subjected to a smelting process, which involves the use of heat and chemical reactions to extract the copper from the ore. This process typically takes place in a smelter, where the crushed ore is heated in furnaces to high temperatures. The purchased copper raw material is typically obtained in diameters specified by the manufacturer. To achieve wire sizes suitable for each product, the raw copper wire undergoes a continuous drawing process. This involves passing the wire through a series of drawing machines, including a rough drawing machine, a medium drawing machine, and a fine drawing machine. The wire is gradually reduced in diameter and elongated in length during this process. To improve its flexibility and appearance, the wire is annealed in a nitrogen environment. The lubrication and cooling system ensures proper heat management, preventing equipment damage. Stranding involves creating wire strands during the insulation or protective covering process. The specific stranding technique depends on the product type and manufacturing technology. Different methods include soft copper stranding for producing flexible wires with multiple strands, 30 to 75 strands, and rigid copper stranding using a stranding machine for producing wires or cables with 7 to 37 strands. Following the stranding process, the wire cores proceed to the insulation phase. The specific method of insulation varies depending on the type of cable being manufactured. For flexible electrical wires like CU, PVC, PVC 300 to 500 volts, the wire cores undergo color coding, with black and white sheathing applied to distinguish between different phases during installation. This color identification simplifies the process of connecting the wires to the respective devices. In the case of power cables with copper conductors CU, XLPE, PVC, 6000 to 1000 volts, a different insulation approach is employed. The insulation material used is XLPE, cross-linked polyethylene, which offers superior insulation properties compared to PVC. Due to its enhanced insulation characteristics, the XLPE insulation layer can be made thinner than PVC while maintaining equivalent or even higher insulation performance. As a result, the overall cable size and weight are reduced, leading to more efficient cable installations and material savings. The insulation layer serves multiple purposes. First and foremost, it acts as a protective barrier, shielding the wire cores from external factors such as moisture, temperature variations, and mechanical stresses. This insulation ensures the integrity and longevity of the cables, enhancing their overall durability. Additionally, the insulation layer carries important product information. It typically includes details such as the manufacturer's name, cable specifications, and relevant industry standards. This information facilitates proper identification and selection of the cables during installation and maintenance procedures. Moreover, the insulation process contributes to the aesthetic appeal of the cables. A neatly applied and visually appealing insulation layer enhances the overall appearance of the product, particularly in scenarios where the cables are exposed or visible. In summary, the insulation step in cable manufacturing plays a vital role. It provides crucial protection to the wire cores, imparts necessary product information, and contributes to the visual appeal of the cables. By employing appropriate insulation materials and techniques, manufacturers ensure the safe and efficient operation of electrical systems while meeting industry standards and customer expectations.
Protective insulation is applied to electrical wires and cables for several purposes. It safeguards the entire wire or cable core, including the conductor and insulation, from external factors that may affect its quality or reduce its lifespan. The insulation layer also serves as a platform to display product information, such as product name, specifications, manufacturer, and length markings. Additionally, it contributes to the aesthetic appearance of the product. Power cables are coated with a black PVC protective layer, while electrical wires are wrapped in a PVC layer available in yellow or red. During the wrapping process, a layer of powdered chalk separates the protective layer from the wire cores. The resulting electrical wires have a shiny, durable, and securely attached protective layer that can be easily stripped during connection or installation. Product information is printed on the wire using continuous printing technology, which provides cost-effective solutions with a higher aesthetic value compared to dot matrix printing. The protective insulation layer serves multiple purposes, ensuring the safety and integrity of the wires and cables, conveying important product information, and enhancing their visual appeal. The black PVC coating on power cables and the colored PVC layer on flexible electrical wires provide physical protection against external elements. Additionally, the printed product information facilitates easy identification and differentiation, aiding in proper usage and installation. By carefully selecting suitable materials and utilizing advanced printing techniques, the protective insulation layer not only offers functional benefits but also enhances the overall appearance of the wires and cables. It contributes to their visual appeal and creates a more aesthetically pleasing experience. The protective insulation layer plays a vital role in safeguarding electrical wires and cables, providing essential product information and elevating their visual appeal. Through the use of appropriate materials and printing methods, it ensures the reliability, safety, and aesthetic quality of these electrical components for a wide range of applications. After the insulation process, the wires and cables undergo the packing stage. Packing is a crucial step in preparing the products for storage, transportation, and distribution. It involves carefully bundling and packaging the wires and cables to ensure their protection and ease of handling. During the packing process, the wires and cables are organized into manageable units or coils. They are neatly wound and secured using various methods, such as plastic straps or tape, to prevent tangling and damage during transit. The coils are typically of a specific length, tailored to meet the requirements of customers and industry standards. Once the wires and cables are securely bundled, they are placed in suitable packaging materials, such as boxes, reels, or drums. These packaging materials provide additional protection against external elements, such as moisture, dust, and impact. The packaging is labeled with essential information, including product details, quantity, and handling instructions, to facilitate easy identification and proper handling. In larger-scale operations, automated packing systems may be employed to streamline the process and improve efficiency. These systems can automatically coil, bundle, and package the wires and cables, reducing manual labor and ensuring consistent packing quality. Proper packing is crucial for the preservation and integrity of the wires and cables during storage and transportation. It minimizes the risk of damage, tangling, and exposure to adverse conditions. Well-packaged wires and cables can be efficiently stored in warehouses, loaded onto vehicles, and transported to customers or distribution centers with minimal risk of product degradation. The packing stage not only ensures the protection and convenience of the wires and cables but also contributes to overall customer satisfaction. Properly packed products are easier to handle, unpack, and install, 
saving time and effort for both installers and end users.